Hello everybody and welcome to VHS Slaughter. VHS Slaughter is a horror game developed by Cap Crow Games, and in this game you play the role of a video store employee that finds a cursed tape. After they play it, their life is never the same. Oh. It was ominous and pretty loud. Oh snap. I'm gonna be late for work. If only rent was cheaper in Firemore. I wouldn't have to work night shifts every day. I feel that, man. I totally do. You know, I can't get enough of these low poly games. I really can't. I'm just eating them up. There's so many of them, and I'm so happy about that. This looks amazing. I love this. Nice little zoom feature. It'll come in handy when I have to look at my lasagna. All right, let's go outside. Yes. Huh. This is cool. I love this. A nice neighborhood. Oh, okay. Already suspicious. Already suspicious. Look at that. Even they're parked on top of the sidewalk. What is up with that? Yeah, let's leave. Can we keep going this way? I should get to the bus. Oh. Oh. There's the bus. Okay. This is awesome. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. What was that all about? Why the honk? Why the honk? Oh wow, that was perfect. I stopped just to look at it. That was amazing. I love, I love that. Hold on. Is that the stuff? It is. That's a poster for the movie, The Stuff. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. It's really old. It's probably really bad, but I loved it. I saw it when I was a kid. It's a terrible experience, but I enjoyed it quite a bit. You know, this job isn't too bad. Not too bad. Not all about. And I say it's not too bad, but we have like lights flickering and all sorts of to pick up this trash. Okay. Well, we found the bathroom just in case. I can't believe they have the stuff. New horror selection. Ah, did we throw it away here? Okay. That's clearly something I can throw trash into and this too. All right, okay. Is this lucky number three right here? It is. Oh my god. What was... <laughs> Blow down. Come on. I'm so happy about that poster. This. Hey man. Sorry for today. I had to leave a bit early, you know. I've got a date with that hot chick I told you about. What? Anyway, don't forget to take out the trash. I'll tell you how it went tomorrow night. What? So he left early. I hate this job now. Oh, we have a customer. Hold on. <laughs> you okay? Oh. Th thank you. Hannah. Hannah says, Hello, my dear. I'd like to return these tapes my husband got last week. Such great, lovely stories. We both like watching romantic movies when we're alone in the house. 
Someone get Anna some water, please. Please. <laughs> anyway, I'm kind of nervous coming here alone at night. An old lady like me shouldn't be out late at night anyway. Eh, that's true. Oh lord, what am I saying? All those cases with missing people lately scare me. And to think that Firemore was a very peaceful town back in my days. Anyway, I'll go now. Sorry for bothering you with all my rumbling. You're, ru you're rumbling? Your stomach not feeling well? <laughs> She's got a bad case of the rumbles. I can hear those rumbles a mile away. Wait, where do, how do I... Where do I return this? Oh, okay. Yeah, that looks like the romantic section. Okay. Still can't believe my coworker left me for a hot date. The nerve. What do I do now? What do we do? Oh, okay. Well, that's locked. Oh, we have a customer. What? <laughs> you have tapes for me? What is up with your arm? You're not human. Not even. Hey, man. This is Rob. Rob says, hey, man. Look, I wanted to watch a movie tonight with my girl. But on the way here, I realized I don't have any money on me. Well, sorry. Can you give me a tape and I'll pay you back? Once I have the money? No, that's not how it works, Rob. What do you mean, no? Come on, man. Your tapes are crap anyway. I... They're not my tapes. Look, you're working at night all alone here. I don't think you'd like to piss off the wrong person. Remember that. It just threatened me. I just work at a video store. These aren't even my tapes. Your hair looks funny. Okay, my shift is finished. I'm, I'm going to leave. I'm assuming I go over to the, um, the bus stop. Okay. Uh, home sweet home. Oh, come on now. I'm going to be late again. You know what? We deserve to be late. It's okay. We deserve the slack. We're going to be fine. Besides, our friend is probably out on a hot date or something like that. I don't know. Not cool. I'm going to use the stairs. I was thinking about just rolling down the hill. Is that dumpster always there? I don't know. Where's our friend? Ah, they're no longer here. It's interesting. Because this is the most ominous looking house to me. I don't know. I feel like everybody's house is like front and center, but that one's just tucked away. I hear a dog. I hear a dog. Here comes the bus. I love coffee. Just had some. You should too. Why are... <laughs> is it going to do that every time I take the bus? Ah, home sweet home. Home away from home. Home. The stuff. Is this uh, another note? What does this say? Hey, Greg. It's Matt. Sorry for leaving early again. Something urgent came up. Anyway, the date went really well. Oh, I'm so happy for you, Matt. I really think Mary likes me. Oh, okay. Oh, I also finally fixed the surveillance camera. You can see at the top right of the counter. Please don't forget to take out the trash. Yes, okay, sure. Oh, look at that. I'm sure we're going to see wholesome things through that. Nothing like serial killers that are waiting around the corner. Speaking of that, I need to check that bathroom every chance I get. Is that plant always there? I don't know. I'm just thinking things are out of place for a reason. E. 
We've taken out the trash. I'm assuming now we'll get somebody. That's still locked. Should leave that open so I can just quickly go outside and escape. But it's not what we want, right? All right, anytime now. Anybody? Maybe we need to look at the surveillance camera. Oh, here we go. Oh, red t-shirt. Red t-shirt. Ah, dude. It's like you have, like, hooves for hands. Like, oh, thanks. Appreciate it. All right, see ya. Wow. I'm sorry. <laughs> Daniel says, hello. I came to return these horror tapes I got last week. Really good stories, by the way. Thanks for recommending them to me. I didn't do that. What are you talking about, man? You know, I can't say no to a good slasher story. Uh, okay. Sometimes I wonder what it'd be like to go out and start chopping heads off and then hang them at the top of my fireplace? <laughs> what? Nah, I'm kidding. I would hope so. I'd store them at a secret room behind my closet. Okay. Ha, huh, kidding again. Anyway, I'm gonna go now. Yeah. Why did the music stop? Are we done? Is the day over for us? No, it's not. Okay. I'm coming. Oh, it begins. Now, who's out here? No one here. Why is it doing that? What in the world? Quit doing that. Oh my God. Hold on. I got a tape. Is this the tape? So weird. Wonder what was triggering that. Guess we're gonna have to play it. He was walking back home alone. You would think he had some security with him. With how much money he embezzled, you would also think he'd have a nicer house. The spooky house. I wonder what he spent all that money on if not security or a nicer home. I guess I'll never find out what our mayor wasted our money on. Hmm. Ooh, what is he eating? A watermelon? Or is it... what? What was that? All right, we're gonna go home. Screw this. Who left this? I think I should go. I don't feel safe anymore. Yeah, I know. All right, let's go. We're leaving. We're out of here. We are out of here. We're done. Oh. That was quick. And it's raining. I love this. What was that tape? Was it real? Maybe? Oh, it can't be. It was probably a prank by a kid. No, I think it was real. We know that it's real. Is the lasagna gone? It is! Look at that! Our lasagna is gone. We're gonna go outside. We need to find more lasagna. <laughs> is our friend here? Nope. No friend. That tree creeps me out. The one that keeps flashing. 
There's that dog again. I wonder if that dog knows something. All right, here we go. Honk. <laughs> hey, is that the van? It is. That's the van that was parked on the sidewalk. Another customer. All right. Here we go. Hey. Can I grab these? No. Not letting me. Looks like I have to talk to them. Harry. Hey. I'd like to buy these two tapes. The Blade Walker and the Whining. <laughs> yes. Hey. Did you see the guy across the street? Why is he looking directly at the store? He's really freaked me out. Is he a junkie or something? Anyway. Thanks for the tapes. If I were you... I'd leave right now. Maybe call the police. You should close the store and leave. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. See ya. Oh, whoa. Are you... Whoa! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> That's one way to leave. <laughs> oh, I think he's right. I should go home. <laughs> yes. Anybody who anybody who moonwalks out of any place, we we really need to listen to them. They they know what they're talking about. Oh my god! And we're back home. And this radio is playing. Oh, this is a loud radio. I can't leave. What do you want me to do? Thing. What is happening? Oh! A body! There's a body! Wow. We gotta keep it together. Come on. A body. Oh no, there's a note on the floor. <laughs> We're screwed. Rotting apples with wasps feasting. Brown bananas with flies retreating. A fox in the night is ripping black bin bags open. Cats are eating a chicken casket after Sunday dinner. A white owl is gobbling a slaughtered mouse happy sitting on the evening fence. The brown rat is running for the bushes after stealing bread. A giant cow jawbone is found in the dirty ground. The tired young man died on the motorway bridge and was found. Zombified humans are eating out of plastic bins. Death is everywhere. Take a look inside. Don't be ignorant about what you find. Okay. And with that, we shall return back to work. Actually, let's just leave. Let's go past work and just, just leave the city. What the hell was that? Creep. All right, here we go. The inevitable honk. Here we go. Honk. <laughs> Why? Oh, there's a lot more people here. What's with these cars? Nobody else here. Hmm. No note. Our coworker just stopped. They said something came up. I'm pretty sure they're dead. Hey. It's Hannah. Oh, my dear. Something terrible happened. Oh, no. Her husband's dead. Watch. I didn't know where else to go. I had to come here to speak with someone about it. It's James, my husband. I can't find him anywhere. He went for his usual walk, but he didn't return. He's always back at seven. Oh no. He's never late. What should I do? Could this serial killer person abduct him? It's all over the news. They believe someone is responsible for all these missing people. Oh lord. 
I tried to call the police, but they didn't bother. They have more important cases to investigate. Oh, Lord. I have to get back. Oh, poor Hannah. Well, I hope she finds her husband. Can you imagine if she moonwalked out of here, too? Can we just leave? I don't like this. I feel like the next person that's going to come in is probably... Oh, it's too late. Huge Horrible Man, part two over here. Thanks. Derek. Hello. I'd like to return these... Man, I hope the weather gets better. Anyway, thanks. Bye. All right. Thanks for returning these. See ya. What did it? Did his body just kind of squish for a moment? All right. Let's return these. Where do I put these? Oh. Okay. Hey. Hey, we're. Hey, what are you doing, man? Sorry, we're closed for tonight. Uh, did I just give him the tapes? This music. And with that, he's a lot more shinier than the usual customer. All right. We're going to go. There we go. Another one. This radio. Oh, we got to go. We got to get out of here. This is so strange. Well, Hannah's husband is missing. You're co-worker I almost said friend he's no friend <laughs> your co-worker hasn't returned or rather hasn't filled in at all so you've just been taking up every single shift you've been working non-stop this is supposed to be a night job what happened honk there we go Oh, it, there's another note. Finally. Hey, Greg. It's me, your coworker. I decided to leave Firemore. I guess you won't ever see or talk to me again. Oh, well, I never liked this godforsaken town anyway. Crime being on the rise and the cops not doing anything about it. People who look dead both on the inside and on the outside. This town deserves people like these. Interesting. Well, I knew something was up. I knew he was gone. Always need to check these doors. What? Where did you just pop from? Just boop. We have an endless supply of customers. They just come up from the parking lot. Oh boy. Hey. Oh no. I'm not here to buy tapes. I saw a nosy guy outside. He told me to come here and tell you he's giving you an invitation. What? I don't know anything more. He just gave me five bucks to come here and tell you that. He said you should be very careful with your choice. What? Wait, is there anything on the video? No? Okay. All right, well, with that being said, I'm going to leave. The power went off? Well, that's not my problem. I'm leaving. All right, I guess. Okay. Has to be back here. Is it this thing? There we go. 
think we're back in business. Is that another tape? We were about to leave, but against better judgment, like always, wait a minute, there's something on the wall. I can hear them calling me from hell? What? Wait a minute. Is there anything else? Oh boy. Prisons are made to hold criminals, yet people like her keep them free. She was out for a walk, proud of her winning another case. It was the defender of a murderer. She just needed a little payback. What goes around comes around after all. This guy is just going around, just getting everybody, apparently. All right, with that, I'm going to go. I'm going to leave through this. I don't get paid enough. I really don't. It's a quiet morning. Excuse me, it's a quiet evening. <laughs> quiet morning. Maybe it is the morning, like super, super early. Because we have to fill in for our coworker that ended up leaving Firemore. Like waiting for the bus in real life over here. Here we go. Let's give it just one good honk. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> All right, we're gonna just go straight in here. Nothing. No writing on the wall either. All right. You know, every time I open that, I'm just expecting somebody to just be there. Ah, a customer. Hello. Hey, Greg. It's, it's Jenna. Jenna knows me? Have you seen Matt? I can't find him anywhere. Uh oh. I haven't heard from him for a week. Oh no. I really hope he's okay. Come find me after your shift to look at his house. We'll meet at your place. Yeah, what did I say? Matt is dead. <laughs> you know what? I'm just gonna go. Going straight to my place. <laughs> Screw this. I don't wanna work no more. Okay. Whoa. See? This is where they spawn from. Customer spawning center right there in the middle of the parking lot. Hey, Derek, excuse me. Don't you think it's kind of late to do repairs on the roof? I just saw your coworker on the roof fixing something. It's not safe. Go right now and tell this man to come down. Wait, there's no one back. I'm the only one that that's working here today. Oh boy, here we go. Someone was straight up living over here. Sleeping bag, everything. Backpacks. Oh no, a, and a tape. A lot of murder weapons here. 
That's not good. I guess we're playing this tape. Can we jump off of this? No. <laughs> and we're going down. All right, here we go. What's with this music? Why is this open? <gasps> the body in here. Yeah, that's a body. That is definitely a body. You have been quite the fan of my work. You seem to enjoy my work. I extend this invitation to you. Join me. Let's clean up our city from these scum. Call me. Interesting. So is this killer giving us a choice to join them in the killing spree? Or perish? Is that our choice? I'm hearing whispering. The killer is taking over my mind right now. The phone here. Call police or unknown number. Hmm. Let's call the unknown number. The news gave me the name of the abductor. I'm not interested in acts of violence. However, I adore this little rotten town and I will do anything to clean it from the filth it has. It, oh. So we chose the, the the evil route is that is that what it is interesting okay so i'm assuming if you choose police you'll probably apprehend him maybe so let's go ahead and go for that ending let's go straight to it i'm just going to skip over the the replay and i'm going to see what that other ending is about this can't keep happening i need to end this now okay so here we go. We chose unknown number last time. So this time we're going to go with police. Let's see what happens. You were the worst kind of man. 911, what is your emergency? Too afraid to make a difference. Too afraid to take initiative. Oh, we got killed in our own home. Okay, well, you either become the killer or you get killed. Interesting. Well, folks, that was VHS Slaughter. I really enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun. I love these horror games, especially any sort of like low poly VHS style horror game. I just love these. If you enjoyed watching, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel to catch us next time. I hope to see you again. And as always, take care. Peace. I'm out of here. Bye-bye.